Joseph in the Bible is called by our sages a righteous person who is the veritable foundation of the world. Sadiq Yesod Olam. Why is that? One reason is that the Hebrew word for Joseph, Yosef, contains the same letters as the Hebrew word Pius, which means reconciliation. Joseph was able to nullify himself and make peace with his brothers and forgive them, reconcile with them. But there is a deeper level to Joseph's emotional and human grandeur and greatness. Not only did he forgive his brothers, he was also be able to reconcile internally, soulfully, within himself, everything that's happened to him, the slavery, the imprisonment. He was able to move beyond self-embitterment and resentment. In this week's Torah reading of Kedoshim, the Torah tells us, Hate not your brother, your fellow Jew, your fellow American, in your heart. Don't bear a grudge and don't be resentful. The Torah doesn't want us to be petty and small and diminished souls who keep a score sheet and wait and lurk and long, God forbid, for somebody's downfall. The Torah wants us to be better than that. The Torah wants us to be emotionally emancipated and mentally evolved and benevolent and forgiving human beings. Let go of the toxicity of others, especially those who wronged you. You're bigger than that. That's why every night before we say the nocturnal Shema and fall asleep, there is a preceding paragraph in which we say to the Master and Sovereign of the Universe, Hareni Mochel, I hereby forgive for anyone who may have aggrieved me, whether physically, whether emotionally. It's not about doing a favor to that person who probably did really hurt us. It's about being able to cleanse our souls from the toxicity of resentment, embitterment, embitterment detestation, and malice. A person who can let go of hate, like people who went through the unthinkable and went on to celebrate life, is a person who cleanses cynicism and negativity from their midst. And they can leave and lead a cleaner life. They can have a more inner and pristine environment and they can live in greater joy and blessing to others. Hate not your fellow brother in your heart. Be not resentful, be not vengeful, be not a small soul, be a benevolent, evolved, elevated, and forgiving soul. Amen. Have a beautiful, healthy, and blessed day.